Hello everyone and welcome back to elearnmarkets.com YouTube channel. In our previous video, we learned about IMPS which is an electronic fund transfer mechanism. Now in this video, we will understand about an advanced version of IMPS which is the UPI. It stands for Unified Payment Interface. Now about the features and how it functions, we will understand it through the slides. Now let us first quickly understand as to what is a UPI that is Unified Payment Interface. UPI enables all the bank account holders of the participating banks to send and receive money from their mobile phones or smartphones with the virtual payments address that is the VPA without entering any additional bank account information. This means that in case of UPI all that you need is a unique ID generated through the UPI app and your money will be transferred instantly by entering those details. How do we create a VPA? For example, let us take ICICI Bank into consideration. In case of ICICI Bank, you need to either download iMobile app or Pockets in your phone. Assign VPA to your ICICI Bank account using service section of the iMobile section or UPI section under the case of pockets. So in this case, if you download iMobile or you download pockets in case of ICICI Bank, you need to take the following steps for creating VPA. Now how do you transfer money via UPI? The procedure is simple. First you need to open the application login and click on the option UPI. Under UPI, choose the option Pay with VPA. Enter the amount to be paid. Add receiver's VPI, that is add the details of the person who will be receiving money. Review the details therein. Submit and initiate the payment. In case of any queries, please do write us back at the email ID mentioned herein. With the advancement of mobile wallet services like Paytm, Mobivit, the significance of banking services is almost lost. But with the technological advancement like UPI, banking services have regained its importance. In the case of UPI, the significant factor is that the RBI has restrained the other players, the other mobile wallet players from entering into the field and only the banks can participate through UPI. Hope we've been able to explain you this system in the most simplest manner. In case you liked the video, do not forget to share and comment on the same. Thank you for staying connected with us. Happy learning.